Hi, Judy from Witch Peace Craft. Welcome. Well, today's video is the final draw for my six month make along Shutterbug AU. Yes, I am a little late, but that was deliberate. I decided I would give the people in the Northern Hemisphere time to get everything in because sometimes they forget about the time difference and we're ahead of the Northern Hemisphere. So I'm fairly confident everybody is in and I'm going to do the prize draw. First off the ranks will be the June participant prize for a $25 gift voucher. Then I will do three prize draws. First person out will win a mystery box from me that I will mail to them. That winner will have to let me know if they like acrylic, if they like wool, if they don't, if they only want cotton. Uh, let me know or none of the above and we'll see what we can put in this mystery box or arrangement we can come to. The second prize is a $25 gift voucher. The third prize is a $10 pattern prize or a $10 voucher if I can organise one. So the projects were amazing. We've had a lot of fun, a few laughs along the way. The blankets came together lovely. The shutter bugs came together great. I have finished my shutter bug. He is huge. I'll show you him. I'll have to put a photo at the end, I think. There he goes. That is my shutter bug. Finished. Lots of colour. It was a lot of fun to make. Fairly easy. Putting together wasn't so easy. I have left him a bit softer here so a child can grab him by the neck. But yes, he's very big. He's a he. He doesn't have a name yet. So if you want to help me name him, you can put a name in the comment below. Right now, thing the other night on WhatsApp when we talked to each other, um, said call him Goma after Goma Pile. I don't know why that is. Um, Reeves came up with Petey because he looks like a centipede without legs. Friends in the office, because I took him to the office because some people wanted to see him finished, said I should call him Gary. No reason other than they reckon he looks like a Gary. So let me know in the comments below a name for him. I know there's a Flash out there, there's a Stewie out there. So yeah, I really don't know what to call him. Hopefully I'll put a photo at the end so you can check him out in his full glory. So, as per usual, at the end of this video, first off the ranks will be the June Participant Prize Draw. Then will be the free prize, three prize draws for the total make-along participants. I think there's 16 names on the wheel. Um, we had about 20 consistently enter. Four didn't want to go into the prize draw, which is fine. Um, it's been fun. Will I do one next year? I don't know. If I do, I might do it slightly different. I've got three ideas at the moment floating around in my head. One, Reeves told me to flick. He said it would cause too many negative comments on my YouTube channel. Um, some people wouldn't see it for what it was. So that one got the flick. I've got a couple of others. So if you've got any suggestions of what could be a fun make along, let me know in the description below. I think someone said last year feature a designer but that can be difficult if they, people don't crochet and only knit or only crochet and don't knit yeah so yeah whatever you can come up with um, one of the ideas two of the ideas I have all depend on where I go for my trip and what I see this year but my little shutter bug or cuddle bug and I will do the prize draw now make sure you congratulate the winners. Not everyone can be a winner, but everyone in the draw worked extremely hard. And I really thank all the participants who took part. There are a lot of make-alongs along going all the time. I've just joined one. I have joined the Amigurumi World Tour, organized by Cassandra from Craftably Ever After, I think it's called, her channel. She sent two same copies amigurumi books out into the world one i think is doing europe and one is doing down here or australia and the southern hemisphere new zealand 
and I can't wait to get that book and make one of the items in it. I think that's a great make along. I just hope it doesn't arrive while I'm on holidays, but she's aware of that. So, if you can help me name my little shutterbug or cuddlebug. Remember, this was a pattern by Hobie, so I'll put a link in the description below. You can make him smaller. One, one of the other girls experimented and make him, made him smaller. All I did was use my 8-ply or 3-weight scraps doubled up to make him. The head is actually almost one ball of a cake yarn from Big W. Can't remember what it was called. But here you go. So stay tuned for the prize draw and have fun. Make sure you have one crafty day and keep posting your projects on Facebook, in the Facebook group if you do, or send me pictures because I really like to see them. Thank you once again, everybody, for participating. Good luck, everyone. Welcome to June's participant prize draw. Um, this participant will win a $25 gift voucher and it's the last participant prize draw in the six months make along of Shutterbug AU. Good luck everyone. Congratulations Sue Smith, you have won our June participant prize draw. All you need to do is email me and claim your prize. Thank you for participating. Welcome to our major prize draw for the Make Along Shutterbug AU. Three prizes to be drawn. The first person out will win the mystery box that I will mail out. Second person out will win a $25 gift voucher. And third person out will win a $10 pattern prize or a $10 gift voucher. So let's get started. First person. Congratulations to Chantelle. She is our overall prize winner and she will receive a mystery box of goodies from me. I'm going to remove the winners to make it fair, like you can win one prize. So I'm going to remove Chantelle. Our next prize winner is... Abby M. Congratulations, Abby. You've won yourself a $25 gift voucher. And for our last prize, Trish the Knitting Lady. She has won herself a $10 pattern prize or a $10 gift voucher. Congratulations, everyone. Make sure you congratulate everyone. Winners, if you could please email me your contact de details and claim your prize, we'll work out what you would like to receive. Thank you everyone for participating. It was really a lot of fun. Bye for now.